Hey guys, it's your boy the B Minus Gamer here, and here we are for the first edition of the Manchester United FIFA 15 career mode. Oh my goody goodness, what is going down? What is going down? Let us click into this right away. No more looking at uh, Brendan Rodgers' ugly face. No, go, go, go away, go away. And let's see, let's see, what is this? This is the first time I've been playing uh, FIFA career mode. I've only played about four or five games. Uh, in FIFA 15 so far, and uh, I wanted to uh, get this out a little bit later because I wanted to check out like a lot of the the players and their potentials and and who to really bring in and and what am I gonna do with this career mode? So uh, sorry for a little bit of the delay, but here we are, here we are in FIFA 15 Manchester United career mode. Based on your FIFA 15 career progress, you are entitled to the following perks. Oh, some of these items are optional. Please. Check any items you want to apply to your commode that you're about to start. 15% in a uh, transfer budget. Yes, please. Uh, global transfer network. Uh, uh, one top. Oh, we got a free top scout for our first season. Yes, please, as well. Uh, yeah, I'll take both of those. And here we go. Our budget is 51. Look at those wages. Oh my god! Really? 51? Oh, I think this is in dollars. Okay, okay, this isn't in pounds. But yes, we are gonna go ahead and look. That is pretty accurate. Look at those ratings 85 attack, 80 midfield. I'd probably downgrade the midfield to about 78, 79. And uh, defense should be around 65. Let's, let's be honest, that was about a 65 this past weekend. But uh, we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna start here. Uh, for match difficulty, I haven't really played all that much. I, I did that like initial game, and it said that like, oh, you should be playing at like world class difficulty. And then I went and played on world class difficulty and got my ass kicked. So what I'm gonna do for now, I'm gonna start off on professional until I get my feet um, underneath me. Probably until the tr uh, the initial transfer window is uh, is over, and then I'll go ahead and uh, punch it up to world class. We're gonna go six minutes. We're gonna go lenient, moderate. Strict? Does anybody ever go strict in career mode? Like, why would you ever go strict? Anyway, we aren't going to go dollars. We're not going to go euros. We're going to go sterling. Sterling. Uh, download latest. Yes, please. European con uh, competition in the first season. No, I'm sorry. We got to earn that sucker. Let's go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. My office. These are my domestic cup objectives. We'd love a cup run. That's cool. Transfer market is open. We should look for a central midfielder. Even even FIFA 15 does. We should look for a central midfielder. Hey, Richie Taylor. We're going to need you to scout some people. League objectives. We're looking for judge on the success of the league. The objective uh, can also be met. You want us to win the league title? we we'll do that. we we'll probably do that, especially on, on professional. We'll probably do that. Uh, but we will bump it up to world class. So they want us to win the league. I think that's doable. We can also uh, win a, a league cup, which I also think is doable with this roster. Oh, this is new. Look at all of this stuff. This is all cool. Nice. So there's a lot easier ways to, to search for people this year. Uh, first and foremost, you know... He was my favorite player in uh, the past FIFA. Oh wow, look at that. Look at that. It actually like, it does a sh Oh my god, that search is so much- Thank you EA. <laughs> that search is so boss. Dude, add to scout list and inquire about you good sir. Uh, we are trying to get Paul Pogba back, but did you guys see that? Did you guys see the- Oh man, I freaked out. I freaked out at this naming thing. This naming thing's so sick. All right. All right, who else do I want to get? I want to get, I want to get this guy right here. Look at it. It actually like narrows down your selection, and then it gives you. Oh my God, this is gonna save me so much time. Ah, <laughs> uh, this is like a really small thing, but I hope, I hope. I, I mean, it's great because like EA, well done EA. You know what? I'll give you. Ah. Uh, this was worth the sixty dollars, <laughs> or the fifty pounds, or whatever. Uh, this little ah, uh, I'm speechless. EA, you actually did something smart. Well done, well done. Best sports game out there, Rafael Varane. 
We are looking at you. We really need to beef up that back line. Actually, like in FIFA terms, uh, this team, pretty solid. Uh, if I'm not gonna lie, like if we look, as you can see, I, I took I took notes on this roster. Actually, before we go ahead and we we inquire about these players, let's go ahead and look at the active roster for this team. As you can see, we're kind of playing a uh, four 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 two formation right here, with uh, Van Persie, Rooney, Di Maria, Blind, and Herrera. So we got uh, Herrera and Di Maria as kind of the outside of the diamond. Now here's the issue, D like. I like Di Marie on the outside, but we need probably a different player, maybe Herrera and, and Blind, or Herrera and Rooney switching out. Di Marie is fine on that left or the right side. Oh, he's in a cam position? What is this? What is this formation right here? But anyway, as you can see, Chris Smalling, um, Luke Shaw. Luke Shaw, solid. Raphael, solid. I think this back line is actually fairly decent. Um, let's go ahead and plug in... Where where's my boy? Where's Phil Jones face? Oh there he is. Let's get in Phil Jones face right there. But as you can see in this roster, I want to beef up this backline. As you can see, the highest rated player on our backline is a 79. But a lot of these players have really great potential. Uh Danny Blind um has a potential of 83. Andres Herrera has a potential of 84. As you can see, uh Di Maria, Juan Mata, Wayne Rooney, Ron Percy, Falcao, all of them are outstanding already. Um, basically the front going forward we are pretty much set I might want to get uh, a backup striker or two just for you know for FA Cup ties and uh, for short weeks where we play a lot of games we're gonna need to rest uh, maybe the older boys bring some youngsters we need to beef up this back line a little bit but it's not I mean we have pretty good depth on the back line in FIFA terms and real life terms they're fucking awful but in FIFA terms Rojo Jones Smalling and Evans are all serviceable if if not solid Luke Shaw uh, FIFA 14 legend his potential has only gone up since moving to Manchester United so he's solid but we do need someone behind him as well as Rafael we also need someone behind him they say uh, Danny Blinn and Marcos Rojo can play that outside but from the few games that I played you need really fast backs because bombing down like defending wingers that bomb down the the wings is just a fucking nightmare they get this little speed boost uh, and then they're just like they're off into the races and if you don't get that speed you're just not gonna fucking catch them players with pace and high dribbling in this game are gonna be king like by far I mean strength matters as well but but pace agility and ball control I think are the main things that you want because dribbling is just I was trying to pass through the defense on world class and it just wasn't happening but I could dribble through the whole entire team almost with team Maria and if I didn't get past someone, I usually got fouled. So I think pace this year, pace and, and technical ability. So the players, the likes of like the, the Neymars, the Bales, the Cristiano Ronaldo's. And finally, I think Messi is actually going to be a uh, pretty fucking beast in this game because it is rough. It is rough to tackle in this game too. I There were counterattacks where I literally couldn't react in time. I literally couldn't do anything. It was just like boom, 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 boom. It's in the back of my net. It was rough. And we're going to go ahead and add Fabian. Oh my god, this is another thing. Ah, oh, thank you, EA. Look at this search bar. Look, do you remember in the old, like, in, in the past couple iterations, I would always see the name of a player, and now it'd be like Fabian Schar. So I would type in S-C-H-A, and then look it up, and he wouldn't pop up. You know why? As you can see down here, Fabian Schar over the A has those two dots, or whatever they're called. I don't know what they're called. Um... And that would register as like a totally different letter. And then EA uh, got smart in this version. They got smart in this version. Oh my god, this is the greatest. Oh, this is the greatest like career mode advancement ever. <laughs> is helping out the search list. And another guy who's been long rumored I bought him in the last career mode. So maybe I won't get him in this career mode. But I love him. As you can see, I styled my hair after Marcos Royce. That's... That's partially untrue, but kind of untrue. I love him, love him, love him. What I want to do is I, I want to play with this career mode. I want to play with the base players. Uh, but at the same time, I do want to bring in some more youngsters. The issue is that this team is pretty well developed already. Like this Manchester United team has some of the top rated players in the offensive positions already. So I will be doing a secondary career mode that is more focused on youth and uh, finding young players, young, outstanding young players and bring them in. So. Uh, have no fear, have no fear indeed. I will be doing um, 
uh, a career mode, more focused around that. Let's see what are these initial prices here. Paul Pogba will consider in the range of 24 million. I would do that. Varane in the range of 16 million. Pretty darn good. Marcos Royce, 77 million. Probably not going to get Marcos Royce <laughs> in this career mode. I will gladly trade Valencia. Let's go ahead and bump that to 11 and see what they will do to get back to us. Rafael Varon, let's go ahead to that transfer. Let's gonna go ahead, we're gonna trade out one of our guys right here. First one, Johnny Evans, a pretty penny, 6.5. You might wanna even get him for less. So we're gonna go ahead and bump that to seven, see if they will nibble at that. But Juventus has accepted Paul Pogba. Come back to Manchester, we cannot get you here soon enough. Please agree to terms. I will gladly, gladly, gladly bring you back. Arturo Vidal, uh, Varane, Rafael Varane. Let's see. Let's bump it up to nine and see where we can go from there. And see where we can go up there. I think we're just going to have to give up on Marcos Royce. He's a little bit too pricey. And Paul Pogba offer accepted. There we go, lads. There we go. Ah. The prodigal son returns Paul Pogba. It's in the team! The first team. Hopefully that intrigues you to come here. And let's see. Let's go ahead and play around with the wages. Look at that. Let's bump it down to 80 and we got 35 to play with. So this is Soko. I mean, look at those stats. Those are really well-balanced stats. Good finishing as well, too. Can I play a midfield role, though? Can I slot him in, too? He can also play CM. So we're going to go ahead and look at Musa Sissoko right here. See what we get here. Offer accepted. Straight up for Ashley Young. Uh, can't argue with that, man. He's a good player. You know, do important first team and try to get him in. Ooh. Chelsea wants him again. You give me 97 mil. And you could go ahead and have Wayne running Chelsea. All right, once again, another final, a bunch of another final scouts. We have reviewed it, and he's not worth his price. So that's who have to stop presenting this player. You consider the inscription is over. Good. Get the fuck out of here. People are offering a lot for uh, Bacali over here. I think we might have to blow him out the water. That is a new development, I must say. That's kind of cool that you know what other people are offering, and that kind of bids you up at the same time. That's pretty fun. All right, so we've bumped it up. They've counter-offered 34 million, but it's quite obvious. I'll I'll come meet you in the middle. Let's go 40. It's not overbuying Liverpool. I know you got that money. You got that Suarez money, Liverpool. I know you got that Suarez money. So you might want to go get that. Ah, let's go ahead. I do love this player, and I think he'd do pretty good work out on that right mid. If we put him in, PSV uh, renewed and we can't accept it because we have accepted an offer from another team. Oh, there we go. I got beat out for Zachary Bacali for another team. That is interesting. Ooh, I can submit a new offer. So apparently I got beat out, but I can submit another offer for 4.3. This is so interesting. Oh, new wrinkles. Motherfuckers. All right, now this is just gonna, I thought this was charming at first, but now it's just, it's fucking ridiculous. Now, can they lie to you? Can they be like, oh, well, this guy's offering me this, and that guy's offering me that? You know? You know what I'm saying? I don't know. I don't know if I can afford all these players, but it's it's good to have options. It's definitely good to have options. Contract offer accepted. What does that put us at? 18? All right. All right, all right, all right. Definitely. I'm not going to regret that one. Transfer offer for Wayne Rooney. From who? PSG. PSG, you know the rules. Give us 97 mil for Wayne Rooney. He's all yours. All yours, guys. We have reviewed. He's not worth a much this. We have decided negations are over. That's fine. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Let's sim the match. Big bucks, no whammies. Oh, fuck. I put... No! I have good people on the bench. Don't sub anyone. Don't sub anyone good in. Uh-oh. 
Oh no, they did not fix simming injuries in this at all, did they? Already one player on their team is hurt. Do not sub in anyone good on my team, please. Oh no. Uh oh no. It's fine, they scored at us. It's fine. Good. Game. Ugh. Ugh. <laughs> Holy shit. That was nerve wracking. Let's see what happens. Transfer offer for Wayne Rooney. You give me a fucking 141 mil. No, you know what? Give me 200. You know what? Give me 300 mil. 300 mil. I want to see the response. <laughs> Let's see. They offer 44 mil. I told you last time. I'm going to just keep on upping the price, man. You want them, you got to pay something outrageous. That's all I'm saying. 8.5 said to match it. All right. Chris Smalling is out the dough. Price tag you set for Wayne Rooney. And uh, we do not believe he is worth that much. Thus, we have decided to stop negotiating the interest on this player. You consider negotiating is over. Good. Suck my fucking dick. Contract offer. Oh, fucking finally. All right. We got one, and then we'll play Hong Tong on the other side, and then we'll be fine. All right. That is some work. That is some business work done. We are good. We are set. Let's play. Yeah, let's play. Let's play. Manchester United versus Swansea City. And here we go into our initial match now in real life. I totally forgot about the, the end result of this game. What happened What happened in real life in this game? I, I don't even remember. But here we go. Opening day. Opening day in FIFA 15. There we go. Angel Di Maria in the game. I'm liking a lot more how the player models look this year. Like I'm liking how skinny they almost look like cartoonishly skinny at times. The way that they look, but it still looks like a lot better. I thought they were like really kinda like buff and beefy, unwieldy looking people in uh in the previous FIFA, so let's see how we do this. We're gonna go ahead and play counterattacking. No wait, let's counterattack. Counterattacking is up. Let's try offside trap and let's play. Let's give it off to Rooney. Where am I going? Where am I going? Am I going with the ball back to Rooney? Punch it forward. Oh, there's no one support. Fuck how? I needed you, man. Where were you? That is my only concern about the strike force. They are very powerful, but they're two kind of more lumbering, technical, uh, technically gifted backs, uh, center forwards. And uh, not exactly the, the strongest. Oh, I get down there. Oh, it gets hit away. Oh. And we get away with one right there. That was some bad defending on my part. Di Maria, give it back to Di Maria. He's going to do some damage. Oh. Get done, son. Give it to Rooney. To Sissoko. Back to Rooney. To Angel Di Maria. Get it to the outside. Ah, let's get it in. Get it! Oh, Falcao. Skying it over. Maria, I think I can cut in. There we go. There we go. There we go. Oh, final ball. Jess, we gotta get the ball to Di Maria. That's all there is to it. Falcao, too much space. You're giving me too much space. You're giving me too much space. Oh, great defense. Great defense by Ian Williams right there. Thought I might have had that finesse shot right there. Maybe should have gone near post. Near post is pretty OP, and this is what I'm going to do. No baits in 87 cheese right here. Just near post. Near post cheese. Oh, oh, Rudy. Rudy, get to it. No. <laughs> oh. oh, how did I not score? How did I not score there? How did I freaking not score? Ah. Uh. It's fine. And that is how it'll half that is how it will end nil nil going into the half. Wayne Rooney is hidden off the post. Unlucky. Unlucky indeed. He's going for it. Oh The foul there? Foul on me. Foul on them. Alright. There we go. A little bit too far away. Let's go ahead and give this to somebody. Give it off to Pogba. Oh, another outrageous tackle right there. 
I don't know what they think. They can. Oh my God! <laughs> Jesus Christ, computer! Yeah. God damn, Routledge just fucking destroyed Wade Ritty right there. They all the exact same spot. We just start back at one apparently. Oh my god. They're just flying. They are just fucking. They do not give a shit about yellow cards in this game apparently. Here we go with this. And Rooney. Come up with Paul Pogba. Come on the inside. Takes a shot. Ah. Oh, where are you looking? Nope. Refuse. Oh my god. Woo! Woo! Sneaked out of there. Alright, we're doing Rooney. Cuts in. Sit over the top to no one. Oh, come on. Come on, guys. Danny Blind. Outside, Di Maria. Oh, he's too tired. Di Maria is just too tired. And that's how the game will end, boys. That's how the game will end. Not the greatest performance by myself. I'm still getting used to the system. But uh, we get a 0 0 tie. Had a couple decent shots on target. But uh, yeah, yeah, it's going to be a work in progress. I've just picked up this game. Anyway, I think this is probably going to leave it off. I've been playing for a good couple of hours right now doing these transfer windows. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed uh, this edition of Manchester United FIFA 15 Career Mode. I've been your boy, the V Minus Gamer. And remember, I will get back to you as soon as possible with more videos to come. So stay tuned, stay tuned. And until next time, guys, stay humble.